Hello everyone and welcome to the WSO2 Identity Server Single Sign-On Demo. In this demo, I'm going to show you how to configure WSO2 Identity Server for Single Sign-On using two sample applications, Pickup Manager and Pickup Dispatch. So let's take a look at how this is done. So I have deployed the two sample applications that I'm going to use for this demo, Pickup Dispatch and Pickup Manager. I've deployed them on a Tomcat server which is running on my terminal window over here. As you can see, Tomcat has started and I've accessed the two applications on my web browser window. You can also try this out using different applications, but if you wish to try this out using these two particular sample apps, you can check out the documentation for download links and instructions on how to deploy it on Tomcat. Once you've set up the two applications, the next thing that we're going to do is create a service provider to represent each application in WSO2 Identity Server. I have started up the WSO2 Identity Server product on this terminal window. And as you can see, it's giving me the management console URL. So let's just copy that and paste it on a browser window to access the management console. So once I'm here, I need to give credentials to log in. Um, so I'm going to use the default administrator credentials, which is admin, admin, and sign in. So this is the home screen of the management console. And now we are going to click add under service providers and add a new service provider called pickup dispatch, click register. And the next step is to configure SAML authentication. So expand the inbound authentication configuration tab and then expand SAML to web SSO configuration and click on configure. All we need to do is enter the issuer and assertion consumer URL. So the issuer for this is SAML to web app pickup dispatch.com. And enter the assertion consumer URL and click add. So now I've configured the service provider, and SSO is enabled by default for each and every service provider in WSO2 Identity Server. So all we need to do now is click register, and the service provider has been added successfully. And I'm going to click update. And now the service provider is listed under my list of service providers. Now we need to create a service provider for the pickup manager application as well, just like we did for pickup dispatch. So I'm going to add another service provider, call it pickup manager. And I'm going to configure SAML authentication for it. And this time I'm going to add SAML to web app pickupmanager.com as the issuer and enter the relevant assertion consumer URL for this application. Now I'll just click on register and finish adding the service provider and it has been listed over here. Now that we have configured SAML authentication and SSO for our two sample applications, let's try to log in and see if SSO works properly. Let's first log into the pickup manager application so I will enter the default admin credentials, admin, admin. And now I'm logged in to pick up manager as the admin user. And now that I have a logged in session in pickup manager and we have configured SSO between these two applications, if I try to access the pickup dispatch application and just click login, you will notice that I'm not prompted to enter my credentials again. So I click login and I'm immediately redirected to the home page which means SSO has been configured successfully. And that brings us to the end of this demo. I hope you learned how to configure SSO with WSO2 Identity Server. If you do need more information or more tutorials like this, please do check out our documentation. I hope you enjoyed this demo. Thank you and goodbye.